and one in which we just, uh, Larry and I, were part of the group. That everyone added jokes to whatever, but they were written by Schiller and Weisskopf. That's but the attempted rape. It's a marvelous, marvelous show. Some people say, how can you make, how can you make fun of rape? Well, first of all, the rape didn't occur. Secondly, if you want the truth about rape, watch documentaries, and you can give greater lessons of what it's all about by humor, by pointing out the foolishness as well as the evil. As a matter of fact, in the second, there was a follow-through in which mm, Archie Bunker's wife did not, wa did not want to point a finger to the to the rapist, to the, the guy who attempted rape. It's too much to live through it and so on. And the point why she had to, so that other people would be safe. Now, about the humor in the rape sequence. At, at one point, we're doing a rehearsal. We saw him, the rapist with a knife just about to cut her like that, and it was like uncomfortable. It's like too much for, too much serious. So we began to find humor in that, and the point we found, how can she stall him? There's humor in stalling him. And there was some very funny things like, would you care for coffee? Would you care for sack? Would you care for sack? I got a laugh like that. Or, and this is her character and still got a big laugh. She said, I have to go to the bathroom. She starts going, and he follows her. Where are you going? I'm not going to let you out of my sight for one second. She were, went right back to the possibility of being raped. That's such a great thought. Her nudity, her self-respect, her tidiness about herself is more important 